now I've got the task of reaching the phone from where I am sat now. <sighs> got it. Hi, welcome to a Q&A. This was not my idea, this was her idea. Was it? Be on the camera. Yeah. Might be like an idiot again. Oh, <laughs> and it's... <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's going to stay in the old video, but we will certainly try. What is it? Yeah? But when was it? It actually is... Oh, the first numbers. My first numbers! Because I don't know how to count to ten, so... Right, let's go and do the first question of the Q&A. Are you ready? Oh, that ain't happening. Right. <laughs> question number one. And besides... As all the questions I've got sent in, I've, I've picked most of them, and the, the ones that I haven't picked, I'll save for another video. So, right, I'll be ready. First few are from Lawrence. Yeah, right. What's been your favourite moment of each year from 2015 to 2019? Right. 2015, I would say prom. I mean, if I think back to that year, that's the only thing I can say that was really good about it. Um, other than that, I don't know, I was at school last year, year 11. Oh god, that makes you feel old, doesn't it? Last year you was at school, she just said. No, the last year of school was oh. in 2015. Oh yeah, I was at school last year, yeah. That makes you feel even older, wouldn't it? <gasps> oh, I'm a savage. I'm joking, you're only like, what, three years older than me. Uh-huh. 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 Uh-huh.
Well, okay. In that anyway, picture. In that picture, he does a bit. A bit. What are your personal goals for the next five years? Become a pole dancer. A pole dancer is at the top of my list. Next one is to have a house to put the pole in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was actually not a genuine answer was to have a house of my own. Or at least at least or at least ask to have a house. Even if you're raining here, I'm just a house. Yeah, able to drive, get into good shape, which I've actually started. Doesn't look like it yet, but I've started it. And then also if I financial stability. A bit boring but you know, need to be you know, sorted in that area. Mm. Good stuff. The next uh, couple were sent in by Reese. So, the first one, <laughs> can you make a better sausage roll than Greg's? Well, I think we will have to put that to the test in a later video at some point. So, your kitchen is going to be used for making sausage rolls, okay? Thank you. Alright, yeah, we have both got to do it and we're going we're gonna to challenge ourselves who can make the better one out of us and Greg's. Yeah, we know, we know, you know what Greg's one tastes like, don't you? Yeah, and the next one, this is where the, the video is going to get a little bit interesting, is could you make a song about missing fast food whilst in lockdown? I really miss it, and um, yes, in fact, I've already made one, so roll the clip. Lockdown got me craving KFC, popping chicken, finger licking mini fillet, so delicious, twisted, toasted, boneless, banquet, singer, zinger, zinger, burger, big daddy, bacon tower, little bit better. Dipping chips and chicken in that gravy, getting wetter. Don't forget the hot wings, sub and sweet chili, grungy pickle store. Make you wanna jump your trousers to the floor. For afters, how's about you? Grab yourself a caramel waffle, crush them. Yeah. Yeah. Lockdown got me craving. Uh, lockdown got me craving. Lockdown got me craving. Stuff. Right, back to Lawrence. He sent a lot of questions. Thanks, he actually packed the video out for me. <laughs> uh, what's the best? Lawrence. Yeah. What's the best and worst piece of advice you've ever received? Best advice is to be yourself because no point faking who you are. Worst advice, I think I've been told before, they, like just give up, you're not making enough money. You know, like. In certain jobs and stuff, like even how I enjoy it. So, what's been the most impactful no you've uh, you've said recently? Uh, like they say, no to toxic people, people that don't need to be in my life. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, <friend of> <laughs> <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> right. What is the most important lesson you hope to teach your children when you have some? Yeah, a hint, mate. Be respectful, be Probably. responsible, be kind, be yourself, and on top of that, be proud of yourself. Right, this is funny. If you got arrested randomly, what do you think your friends and family would assume the, the was the reason for it? <laughs> well, yeah, what would you say if you, if you got arrested? Mm. What would your family assume to be the reason why? Mm. For me, either getting drunk. I don't reckon anymore, but I don't know. Everyone just seems to think I'm an alcoholic. So me, really. Or filming something I shouldn't be. <laughs> what do you think of the current Doctor Who? Um, Shit. Uh, I, 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 <laughs> difficult. I, I'll probably make a separate video on this. But I enjoyed the, um, I enjoyed the, the new series. But I, it's something I still can't get behind her. And thanks, Lewis. Are you a giver or a taker? Give her any day, baby. <laughs> <laughs> You're laughing. <laughs> I got sent that question about ten minutes ago, so I just chucked it in. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, right. I think this is another simple one. Jack sent me a question. If six is seven, then why is bacon beef? What? Oh. Yeah, if six is seven, then why is bacon beef? Is it a rude joke? If it is, I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to think for like, hours. If six is seven. What did beat him up? Then it's kind of like you know. I give you. I, I just, I just think he's been 
Zillion doesn't make sense. Something. Doesn't make sense. On to the last question of the video, <laughs> which is from your dad. Hello, Zero. How you doing? He's gonna like that. Hello, Daddy. Hello. Right. He's your daddy. Yeah, that's right. why I said it. <laughs> if you could be a member of any famous band in history, which uh, band would it be and what instrument would you play? First of all, I can't play any instruments, so that's out of the question. The triangle then. Yeah, well, I can barely play <laughs> that <laughs> in June, I can just hear it. It's ding, 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 dong. Ding, dong. Uh, but I've had a good think about it and I, I would say Adam Levine from A Room 5. Reason being, since he started, he's always been adapting his style and changing it up. Like, so. Uh, it's, it's, the style of music's changed a lot from where you started, so I think I could be like a bit like that. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, that's all the questions I've got on my few slides on here, on your phone, because uh, I borrowed it for the video. But yes, that's all I've really got to say on the matter. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, and bye bye!